Hey everyone, here's how my Thursday went. I wanted to start my day off with a run, so I'm taking some of this Thermavex. It's like an energy powder drink. This is the peach flavor, it's really good, and it's sugar-free, so they use sucralose to sweeten it, which is a low-carb uh, sugar replacement. And I'm just feeling really great. I remember when I was losing weight before, I started to feel more comfortable in tank tops, and um, I'm starting to feel that way again, so it's been really nice. I'm also getting that new laptop going, and Whoa. I just spent a lot of money on this computer. A couple splashes of coffee and now I'm like, I ruined it. Yeah, I think we'll move this off to the side. So before my run, I was able to set up the laptop and get onto those websites that I needed to for the Navy Reserve. So it does look like I'll be able to work from home. Let's do it. You guys miss me? Oh, you still got a little limp? Hi, honey. I think it's time to wash that toy. Thank you all for your comments about Claire and hoping that she gets better. And thank you for the advice on the glucosamine. I'm gonna get them both started on that. That felt really nice. It took me a little while to get out there, so it was actually kind of hot. I'm not gonna take a shower because I know I'm gonna do like a workout video later. So I think I'll just rinse my face off, get my makeup on. I don't really put on too much. Actually, you know what? I will show you guys exactly what I do. All right, hey guys, uh, I'm gonna show you my makeup routine. Don't worry, it'll be fast. I really don't use that many items and I know some of you might not be into this. I just put a new t-shirt on just so, you know, I'm kind of clean, not too sweaty. And then I just washed my face with a simple cleanser, Cetaphil. At the end of the day, after, you know, all my workouts are done, I will usually also use like a face scrub, like St. Ives, um, any kind of scrub from them. Since I have been doing these videos and I've been going out a lot on the walks with the dogs, I do find myself outside more in the sun and I really do need to protect my face. So I started using this daily protection by Eucerin and it's got SPF 30 in it. And it actually feels really nice. I haven't like had any breakouts. So I just use like a little dab of that and we'll just get that all over. I'm also gonna put a little dot on my neck. All right, so let's face the camera this way so we can get a little before pic with some better lighting. I always like to start with the eyebrows. All I use is a dark brown eyeshadow. So I have this eyeshadow palette. I used like those two a lot in the past for like actual eyeshadow, but now I don't use any eyeshadow anymore. I'm gonna show you what I use instead. So I've just been using this really dark brown. When this is gone, I'll just go buy like a small dark brown. This is just one of those like pointed brushes. This one, it's a little bit like stiffer. I'm just gonna like poke at that a little bit and then I'm also gonna blow it. <laughs> That way it's like not too heavy. Okay, so for my face, I'm only using this anti-dark circle eye roller and it just goes here. And this really just helps liven things up. So it's got like a little silver ball roller and I just roll it on here. Then we're just gonna rub that in. It's cool, I like instantly feel like more awake when I put it on. So this is the new thing I added that is probably one of the more expensive items. You just use a little dot. And what I've been doing is using this on my lids. It's more natural. And it's gonna go on the cheeks. Right there like that. And I'm just gonna push it up here. Like right where you smile and your cheeks get puffy. That's where I put it, and then I just come back at an angle a little bit just to get the cheekbone in there. Now we're just gonna finish the eyes. So all I'm using is eye pencil, and that's just because my lashes on the bottom aren't very dark, so I like to just make them pop a little more. And this is just from CoverGirl. It is like espresso color, I think. Yeah, dark brown, and it has that little twisty. I like that, so you don't have to keep sharpening it. And what I do for that is I just go to the bottom, like about halfway, and I just cover right over the lashes. And then I just do a stripe on top where the top lashes are. All right, we are done with the eyes, just using some mascara. I don't really have a preference with mascara. I just try to find one that's waterproof. And if it's on sale, I'll just grab that one. Just going over the lashes. 
And the last thing is the lips. And I already showed you guys that in yesterday's video, but I'll put the colors down below in the description box again. All right, and that is it. That's my makeup routine. Let me show you in the light. We can do a little before and after. All right, it's lunchtime, and we are gonna have one of those steaks we made the other night, along with the frozen casserole. Yep, it's coming back. Remember when we froze all these guys so I wouldn't eat the whole thing? <laughs> so I just kind of run the glass under the sink water a little bit and that way I can pop out the frozen piece and heat it up in the microwave. Once I realized after it was heated, you know, how much fat was in there, it's kind of oozing out, I decided I'm just gonna split that steak up in half and it turned out to be a perfect helping. I'm so glad I saved this casserole. I remember how good it was. Mm, it's so delicious, guys. If you forgot the recipe, it's the video I forget what day it is, but you'll see a big picture of like a casserole on the thumbnail. You know, you're gonna get plenty of energy from this and that fat's gonna keep you full. I don't even care that it's like a small portion, you know, I'm getting used to these small portions, but I'd rather it be a small portion and really enjoy all the flavors of it than to have like something bigger and like, you know, not have it really taste that good. I am a binge eater at heart. That was always my problem. I just really love that feeling of fullness. And so every now and then I do feel the urge to like eat something big and feel full. And when I get that urge, like usually a big salad or a lot of vegetables or something will help with that. Now I'm getting back to this. I left Sam inside and took Claire out for some quality time in the backyard since I knew she wouldn't be able to go for a walk. Somebody was jealous. <laughs> but then I went on a nice long walk with Sam. guys so Sammy and I just got back from a really long walk we did three miles the girls are hungry they're always hungry I'm hungry it is 5 30 almost I was gonna do my workout like something from Beachbody uh, I want to do the like a dance one I think I'm gonna try size c-i-z-e -E. so I asked my friend Casey if she wants to do it because she's not really into like dancing stuff but she said she does she wants to try it out with me so she's um, still like working and so she doesn't know when she'll be able to do it. It'll probably be later this evening. So what I'll do is just eat my dinner now, like eat it early and then maybe in like an hour, hour and a half, I'll do the dance thing. I'm gonna have a steak and I'm gonna saute up some mushrooms to put with the steak, yeah. So we're using these canned mushrooms that I got from Costco. I'm also putting in some of this minced garlic olive oil just to add in a few more calories since you know, I'm not having much with the steak. Also adding some salt, pepper, my good friend, the Worcestershire sauce. And we're not using the half steak, we're gonna use the whole one that we have left. So I heated that up in the microwave, then our mushrooms are done, super simple and tasty. Dinner for one? Nah, I'm just kidding, I got you guys. I'm really glad I got those canned mushrooms because Otherwise, I wouldn't have any vegetables left here. I know I eat a lot of meat. I'm sorry, the vegetarians out there. Next time I go grocery shopping, I'm gonna load up on a lot more vegetables and try to go plant-based maybe for a few days. I just love steak though. Mm. But I could cut back, I could cut back. I'm gonna finish this dinner and then either watch a little TV, maybe read and wait for my friend to call me. All right, so my friend called, she's ready to work out and I'm glad that I ate already because it's already eight o'clock. I'm gonna get it ready here and we are doing a dance one. She said her mom's gonna join us, so this should be really fun.
Wow, that was so much fun and an amazing workout. Like I'm sweating so much. I took the lampshade off my lamp so it's like nice and bright now. Sorry, the lighting is so bad in here um, when it gets like too late. My friend really liked it too and her mom joined in. And yeah, we'll probably do a few more of those because it was great cardio and it's fun. I was on the dance team in high school, so I haven't like danced like group dance in so long so it was like brought me back you know all right so now i really need to take a shower because i have been in these sweaty clothes like all day Ew. thanks for watching another video of my day i hope that it's getting you motivated or keeping you motivated and that you guys are doing really good at home with your weight loss goals too thanks for all your support i love reading your comments and just knowing you guys are here i know i'm just talking to my phone but feel like we're all friends and i'm really talking to all my friends right now so yeah this is great and i love having you guys here have a wonderful day and i will see you guys tomorrow bye